Well, good evening, YouTube, and welcome back to Manning Music. Uh, I really wasn't going to make a video today. I planned on taking a day off, but I was very inspired and impressed upon to do so uh, because I got to go see two live performances today, and it was a really fantastic day. I started off this morning getting to see uh, my best friend and fellow bandmate, uh, the guitarist in my band, he played uh, lead guitar in our worship band this morning at church. Uh, and a, a fine group of musicians, and they uh, every now and then they let me play as well, and, and I, I'm always grateful for the experience. And uh, but what I love about watching my buddy play is that he's, he's uh, very excellent uh, and adept at, at, at taking the little moments, the little spaces in music and, and, and embellishing them and making them better. Uh, with with tasteful, tactful, and and poignant little phrases that that you know there's not a lot of space. Uh, there's not really uh, room for for big face peeling solos, you know, from from 80s and and 90s and metal and things like that and rock and roll. Even that, even though it's rock driven in our worship band, it's it's just it's not the style. Uh, and so he finds these little these little pockets, these little holes that uh, these spaces that are just opportunities and he always maximizes on them and it's uh, it's 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 just phenomenal to watch I love I love listening to what he comes up with he's always creative and it's just it's evidence of, of what a man with a great intuition and a lot of hard work behind him can do and uh, he really he really breathes through his instrument I, I love I love experiencing it um, the second uh, uh, event that I got to go to was uh, my piano professor from college performed a recital this afternoon and uh, again just another consummate performer and and a magnificent one at that he he chose a, a, a monumental uh, uh, set of pieces to play uh, the material was just, it was huge and scary. I mean, all of, a bunch of uh, his piano students were, were in the audience alongside me and, and, and afterwards we were all talking about how, how frightening it would be to, to have to stare at that mountain of music and learn it and perform it as well as he did especially. And it was mesmerizing, um, the whole thing, uh, just magnificent. And uh, he's, he's uh, again, a person that, you know, a performer that has the conversation with the piano and then invites the audience along with it. He, uh, on top of being able to to shape phrases and 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 uh, procure voicing, uh, and and uh, pull off all of the nuance and the subtleties that uh, that I often uh, find very difficult uh, uh, for me. And uh, so it's always a pleasure to to watch him. Uh, like I said, just hold that conversation with the instrument and uh, invite the rest of us along. So, um, uh, and, 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 and the thing that I took away from today, that this is what, what you know, kind of impressed me to, to make tonight's video, go out and, and watch live performances. They're, they're inspiring. They, 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 they make me want to go back and, and, and start practicing again whenever I feel like, oh man, you know, they, and sometimes you watch performers like, oh God, I might as well give up now. That's, you know, I'll never be that good. But, but, but often enough, it drives you back into the practice room for one reason or another. And so please go out and watch and consume live music, YouTube videos, CDs, downloaded music, Spotify, you know, channels and, and, uh, and DVDs of live concerts, they're, they're just not enough. There's nothing like being in the room and experiencing that energy, getting the emotions and the energy off of the stage, uh, off of your fellow audience members, whether you're at some dive bar watching a rock band, um, in a coffee shop watching an acoustic guitar player, or, or at, a, at a formal recital or a symphony concert. There's a very palpable, you can, you can feel it and, and even taste it in the air, energy and uh and it's it's worth going out and being a part of it it will it will change you um you know even if it's if it's such a lousy performance that you're just like well i know what not to do you know that's fine also good uh you know but but go and go and experience it and and be a part of that um so that's that's what got me out here and now here i am in front of my piano which is a long time coming i admit so let's see what uh let's see what i can come up with uh
Have a good evening.